Welcome back. The night market is a great place to shop and taste local, and now it's a good place to give back locally. So here to tell us about a toy drive and the night market's partnership with Step by Step, we have Tanya Torp and Samantha Johnson start stopping by here today. Can you first Hi. tell us about the night market? Yeah, the night market is a monthly pop-up festival um, that hosts about 60 vendors. Okay. And um, that's kind of a different range between food vendors and arts and craft vendors. You don't have to be a business owner to be a vendor. Okay. Um, <clears throat> and we often try to have um, a co-curator as mm -hmm. a part of the night market, which is why we have Step by Step a part okay. of this this time. Um, we do like to give back to other local nonprofits and charities, and so that's where Step by Step comes in. All right, so tell us about Step by Step. We are an organization that's been around for 22 years, wow. and we work with young single mothers okay. ages 14 to 24. We've actually had young mothers as young as 12 with us, and we work to empower them. We're about That's healing great. and empowering them to change their lives. Oh, great. So tell me about the partnership, what you guys have going on. So on December 2nd, we are hosting a toy drive mm -hmm. um, on behalf of the step-by-step uh, -step local organization, and um, we're asking for our uh, attendees to bring new and unwrapped toys to the night mm -hmm. market, and they will be able to donate those to the step-by-step -step booth there. Um, it will be towards the stage area. Um, that's kind of it, really. I mean, I, I was going to go into what step by step is, but I, w I want Tanya to do that. So. Okay. So our young mothers have been earning incentives towards getting these gifts. So they don't, we don't just give them things. They actually earn oh, the things great. that they get. So they've been doing community service. They've been earning points by um, reaching their goals. So okay. we have a goal setting session that we sit down with each of them for a little over an hour. And once they come up with their goals, and it's their goals that they choose, not us, they get to choose them. And they have to reach some of the goals in order to get these gifts. And so they set whatever they want to do, and we help them get there. Things like getting your GED and working towards that, or um, taking a parenting class, things of that nature, getting your finances in order. And so oh, they, they have been earning points along the way by participating as well, uh, and so they get these gifts based on that. The beauty of it is that they get to choose these gifts themselves, and then their children oh. also get to shop for their moms at our Christmas store. So oh. the Christmas store is on December 10th, and so we're asking the community to get together and bring them. They can bring toys at ni to Night Market, or they can also bring them to Emmanuel Baptist Church, but we'll be at Night Market and we'll be having a good time there. Okay, and where is the church that people can bring? So the church is called Emmanuel Baptist Church, okay. and it's located at 3100 Tate's Creek Road. Oh, that's wonderful. About how many young mothers are you working with now? About 100 a year. And okay. so some of our moms are in foster care themselves with their children. Others have experienced incredible trauma, so we make sure to connect them with a lot of mental health professionals in our community. Um, others of them just want a little support, so we give them a mentor if they want one. We help them to, again, get back into school, do things that they really want to empower themselves and their children to live healthy lives. That's great. And Samantha, what inspired this partnership? Well, I know Tanya is a friend, okay. um, and I volunteered with Step by Step um, once or twice. Um, and I, I'm big into missionary work, giving back um, in general, um, and into nonprofit work. Um, and so we were looking for different organizations to partner with all year. Um, but we really didn't have an opportunity to partner with an organization that has such a great cause. Yeah. Um, not to take away from any of the other partnerships that we've done mm -hmm. all year, but none of them were um, kind of in the business of giving back. And so that's kind of what inspired that. That's great. Okay, tell us one more time um, location and date of this night market. Yeah, the night market is at 700 Bryan Avenue. Okay. And um, December 2nd, 2016, uh, from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. And it okay. is the last night market of the season. And um, we encourage everyone to come out. We'll have uh, fire barrels there. If it's really, really cold out, there'll okay. probably be marshmallow roasting, hot chocolate. Um, Ooh, there will cool. still be live music there. <laughs> and bring your coat and your scarf. All right. <laughs> and, a fr and a toy. And a toy, and yes. A toy. <laughs> and a donation. <laughs> well, a wonderful event going on. Thanks for joining us today. Thank you. Thanks for having us. Uh, stay with us. Your Turkey Day Talkers are next.